Are you facing errors during the installation of Chrome OS using Universal Chrome OS Installer? No worries. In this video, I'll guide you step by step on how to fix those errors easily. Just follow all the steps I'm about to show you, and your problem will be solved. So, stay tuned and follow the guide carefully. If your screen is stuck on loading, rootfs is being rebuilt, or patches are being applied during the Chrome OS installation, then follow these steps. First of all, you need to wait for 15 to 20 minutes because sometimes the system takes time to apply the patches properly. But if after waiting, the screen is still stuck, that means there's a problem in your bootable USB. It's possible your boot USB was not created properly. Don't worry, I'll tell you exactly how to fix it step by step. So now we'll make our USB bootable again, properly. First step, you have to turn off Windows security because it sometimes blocks important files during the process. Here's how to do it. Go to the Start menu and type Windows Security. Now click on Windows Security. Then go to Virus and AMP Threat Protection. Click on Manage Settings under Virus and AMP Threat Protection Settings. Now, turn off Real-Time Protection. Next, scroll down and also disable Cloud Delivered Protection, Automatic Sample Submission, and Tamper Protection if it's enabled. This will make sure no files get deleted while creating the bootable USB. Sometimes, it's possible that your Chrome OS recovery file doesn't match with your laptop or PC. In that case, you simply need to download the correct recovery file again. Just go to the official Chromium Dash website, the link is already in the description, or you can search on Google. Chromium Dash Chrome OS Once you open the website, you'll see a search bar. Simply enter your laptop or PC model name in the search bar. I'm downloading the file based on my own device because my recovery file was available. But, if you are not sure which file is correct, or if you don't see any result, no worries. Simply open ChatGPT and type your device details like this. Which Chrome OS recovery file supports my device with? 
name is equal to del inspiron processor is equal to intel core i5 5th generation ram is equal to 8 gigabytes storage is equal to 128 gigabytes ChatGPT will guide you with the right file. And after ChatGPT tells you the exact recovery file name, you can copy that name, Go back to the Chromium-Chrome OS website, paste it in the search bar, and get the exact download link. This way, you'll easily find and download the correct recovery file for your device. First, search with Automatic Update Eligible selected. If you find your recovery file, just download it. But if you don't get any result, then select the second option, Show Automatic Update Ineligible, and search again. If you see a result that perfectly matches your device, download it. Now, connect your USB to your PC or laptop. Then, open the Start menu, search for CMD, and right-click to run as administrator. Once the command prompt opens, follow these steps carefully. First, type disk part and press enter. Then, type list disk and press enter again. Now, you will see all connected disks listed. Carefully check your USB from this list. Identify it using the storage size. Next, type, select disk 2, and press enter. Note, replace disk 2 with your USB number. Then, type, clean, and press enter. Again type, convert MBR, and press enter. After that, type, create partition primary. and press enter. Again type, select partition 1, and press enter. Then type, format fs is equal to ntfs quick. And press enter. Next, type active and press enter. Finally, type assign and press enter. Now, your USB is completely cleaned and freshly partitioned, ready to create a bootable Chrome OS installer. Now, after completing all these steps, it's time to make your USB fully bootable. For that, follow the complete process I already explained in the previous video, the link is given in the description. Or, you can simply search on YouTube or Google. Universal Chrome OS Installer And 
you'll easily find it. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and click the bell icon to stay updated with every helpful guide.